and Ed has a great miracle story about how we can trust in God. Nothing bad ever happens, and when we do that, it gets better than we even expect. Last February, I was sitting in a lavender garden on the top of Belvedere Island at the end of Golden Gate Avenue, and I put my favorite digital camera down beside me on the bench and proceeded to get distracted with the beauty around me. About 9.30 at night, as I was crawling into bed, I heard the rain start coming down, and I instantly remembered where I had left my camera. Um, so I dressed up and got a raincoat on and a uh, uh, flashlight and ran up to the top of the hill. And when I got there, there was no camera, but there was a note, a rain-soaked note, and it, uh, it had a rock holding it down. And I picked it up, and it said, if you left a camera here this afternoon, I have it. Call me at such and such. My name is Janice. So that was fine. Uh, the next morning, we got together, and I, uh, I got my camera, and I gave her my business card in the course of the discussion and left. Last Saturday night, a week ago, Saturday, uh, Saturday night, I was driving back to Belvedere and Tiburon, and I got a call from an officer, Sergeant McVeigh of the Tiburon Police Department, who said, do you know uh, Nan uh, uh, Janice Crum? I said, no, I don't. And I absolutely couldn't remember, because I didn't get her last name. As soon as I hung up, I had a sneaky wallet. Well, what he told me was they had found her wallet in downtown Tiburon, the only phone number in the entire wallet that they could contact, because she turns out she had moved a couple of times, was my business card. And so the next day they returned it to her and she got it back. If she hadn't returned my camera, she probably wouldn't have gotten her wallet back. Isn't that great? Isn't that great? Yeah.